Richard Glossop is set to be executed in Oklahoma Wednesday, despite controversy surrounding his trial and method of execution. Glossop was convicted of murder for the 1997 death of a motel owner. A man named Justin Sneed testified that Glossop hired him to carry out the murder. However, Sneed's testimony has been called questionable by some sources. One being Sister Helen Prejean, who ministers to death row inmates. She wrote a piece published by CNN that claims Sneed gave contradictory versions of the case and that he was pressed during the police's interrogation to claim he didn't act alone. But the Tulsa World reports a 2005 appeals court said Glossop lied about the victim's whereabouts after the murder and about Sneed's role because he felt he was, quote, involved in it. While Glossop is set to be executed, Sneed is serving a life sentence in a medium security prison. On Monday, Glossop's attorney provided evidence that a fellow inmate heard Sneed bragging about setting up Glossop. I don't have any problem with the credibility of my witnesses. Like I said, these people came forward. It's just a delay tactic. These are the games that we, we see in these cases constantly. A separate controversy surrounding the scheduled execution is the method of death Glossop is facing. When used in the past, the sedative midazolam has led to unusually long execution times. The drug was approved in June by the U.S. Supreme Court in a 5-4 split. Justice Sonia Sotomayor likened it to being burned at the stake. CNN reports that Glossop will receive five times the previously used dosage, but Glossop told the outlet, I am worried they will botch it again. Glossop is scheduled to be executed Wednesday afternoon. For Newsy, I'm Catherine B.